What's up everybody, it's 3 in the afternoon and I just woke up, but today I'm going to be talking about everything I have done to my car so far, so let's jump right into this video, I need to get ready. My friend Isaac accidentally took my Ray-Bans, so I need to run over and grab those before he goes to work, so yeah, let's just, let's just get going. I've just taken about 10 or 15 minutes to do my hair, read through comments, answer comments and stuff like that, also drank my coffee, so we're all good on that, and I just wanted to say something real quick before I continue on in this video. I don't know if you guys understand how much I really enjoy when you guys leave comments for me. It's just like, it's really awesome because it kind of like shows me that I have those people there that are still supporting me, you know what I mean? I really enjoy hearing what you guys have to say and a lot of you guys have been recommending things for my car. So like, this one guy recommended I get a stubby antenna which is something I've been looking into but he, he gave me a link to where to get it and everything like that so I, I just really appreciate that guys and don't stop leaving comments and yeah, let's continue on with this video. See you, dude. Have a fun time at work. I will. Peace out. I just got home, and I think I'm gonna mow the lawn real quick, so I'll probably just take a quick time lapse of that. So I hope you guys enjoy. Let's get right into the time lapse, and yeah, let me let me do the little snap thing. Cue time lapse. No. Watch me, watch me. Now watch me whip. Now watch me, no, no. Now watch me whip. whip. I don't even need this, but whatever. These are custom made, dude. You can't even get these on the internet. Plus 50 horsepower. Well, it's 50. How much horsepower do you have now? Uh, about 1,500. Sick. Pulls pussy fucking whole Taiwan, dude. <laughs> All right, guys, just a quick shout out to Remy for those decals, the plus 50 horsepower decals. He's my buddy from school, and I, yeah, appreciate it. I know he watches all my videos, so you're, you're good, dude. All right, guys, so I'm basically just gonna jump right into all the stuff I've done to my car. I've made a list on my phone, and I also got some B-roll shots for you guys, so I'll throw those in as I'm talking about each of these things. So the first thing I have on the cosmetic part is the decals on my hood and my windshield. I uh, put these on like a couple months after I had the car, and I think they look pretty nice. A lot of people don't like them, but hey, you know, have your own car. You do whatever you want to. The second thing I have on my list for cosmetic mods is the carbon fiber vinyl wrap on the interior of my car. I did it around the radio and everything like that, and I also really like how that looks. I also have a carbon fiber bow tie in there on my steering wheel. The third thing that I did was plasti dip the interior, some of the interior pieces, like the rings around the speakers and around the vents and stuff like that. The fourth thing on my list is the Hoonigan banner and the Bernie Sanders sticker on my driver's side door. I really like the Hoonigan banner because, I don't know, I just like to support that brand. And I think Ken Block's pretty cool, so there you go. Also, the Bernie Sanders sticker, I put it on there and I like I was about to take it off, but I decided to leave it on there for a little bit and it really grew on me, so I like it a lot. I think it looks really cool. The fifth thing I have is the decals on my back windshield. That was like the first thing I did. I did it like two or three days after I got the car and I also have that stick shift sticker that I put on when I was still learning how to drive stick and it kind of just, I don't know, it's just a funny sticker. Sixth thing is the black bow ties on my car, so I did the front and back. Chevy logos, black, I just plastic dipped them and I think it looks really nice. The seventh thing is my taillights. I got BMW style taillights and I think they look really cool. It adds a new like, new look to the car and I, I really like it. The eighth thing is my Rally Armor mud flaps. And the reason I put these on is because I, in the winter my car would get caked with snow on the side and I didn't like that so I put those on and it fixed everything. And now, now the side of the car never gets dirty so that's nice. 
And the final thing is my red brake calipers. I did these a couple months ago, and I think it just looks really cool. It kind of adds like a race inspired look to the car, so that's why I did it. So now onto the performance parts. The first thing I did was the intake. It's a KNN short ram. And if, if any of you guys have a cruise or any other car, you're looking to do a first mod to it, I would definitely recommend an intake because it makes the car sound better and it's cheap, pretty easy to install, and it's all around just a good mod. The second thing that I did for performance was the front and rear strut bars. And these didn't make a huge difference, but it definitely stiffened up the chassis a little bit, which was, I don't know, I don't think it was really worth it for the $300 that I paid, but they work all right. The third thing I did was the exhaust. I'll throw in an exhaust clip real quick so you guys can listen to it. I really like how this exhaust sounds. It's a Magnaflow catback from ZZPerformance.com. If any of you guys with cruises don't know about ZZ Performance, they make a lot of parts for the cruises and they're really quality parts. And the fourth and final thing that you guys really should all know about is the wheels and tires that I did. And I got the ESR SR01 tires. They are 18 by 8.5 inch tires and I got 235 40 R18 General G Max a AS03 tires wrapped on them and I think they look really good. I also put one inch spacers on there. The spacers make it poke out really far and I think it just looks really good. It also really increased my handling. It's, 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 it's awesome. I can't really put it into words. So there we go. That's everything I've done to my car so far. Alright guys, so I think I'm going to end the video right here. If you enjoyed, make sure to drop a like down below. Also comment what you thought about the video and uh, share the video with your friends. And subscribe for more videos like this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh, I just ran this. the microphone into the car.